My name is Mike, and this is the hot seat. On the hot seat today, President Barack Hussein Obama should apologize to America and not Afghanistan. President Obama, you should apologize for bailing out the banks and the auto industry. Yet the people of Detroit have a 50% unemployment rate and are living in abject poverty. President Obama, you should apologize to the military for the killing of Navy SEAL Team 6 in a helicopter crash weeks after the alleged speedy execution and burial at sea of Osama bin Laden. President Obama, you should apologize to the American military for not calling out Pakistan on why they were harboring that animal in one of their military bases. Yet, you continue to have our troops senselessly maimed and killed in a losing battle of Afghanistan. President Obama, you should apologize for making this country so angry and so desperate that they want to back flip-flopping liars like Mitt Romney and right-wing right radicals like Rick Santorum. President Obama, you should apologize to America for shooting down the Keystone Pipeline project which would have added tens of thousands of jobs, which would have made us less dependent on the Middle East for oil. President Obama, you should apologize for taking passages of the uh, Bible and tweaking them and twisting them to validate your war against successful Americans. President Obama, you should apologize for being the closet Muslim Marxist that you are. President Obama, you should apologize for saying that you'd be a one-term president if you didn't lower the deficit in half. Instead, you raised it almost $6 trillion under your watch. President Obama, you should apologize to the state of Arizona for them doing a great job in fighting illegal immigration, yet you want to sue them for it. President Obama, you should apologize to America for signing NDAA 2012, which allows the indefinite detention or assassination of American citizens without due process. President Obama, you should apologize for making the future for the youth of America so bleak and so barren that the dream of life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness is practically unreachable. President Obama, you should apologize for being the fake, phony fraud that you are. President Obama, you should apologize for the billions and billions of dollars that you spent on those green energy companies that went belly up like Solyndra and Enter One. But you know, folks, the people that really need to apologize to America are the Americans themselves that continue to support the likes of Sultan Hussein Obama, 
Mitt Romney, and Rick Santorum. And folks, I'm going to apologize in advance. Because when you people vote, one of these three guys in office, and you have to look at your kids and tell them it's your fault that they have nothing, I'm going to be riding you on my show day in and day out for the next four years. My name is Mike. This is the Hot Seat.